So this is water that you are going to treat. So once you add chlorine, this is chlorine, okay? So it will form an ion hydrogen, I'm sorry, a, hy a hydrogen ion, and also the chloride ion, and one kind of facet, and we call it as HOCl, or hypochlorous acid. Okay, so this thing or hypochlorous acid that is that is actually acting as the disinfectant. Okay, not the not the chlorine gas itself, not the chloride ion. So this one is actually the uh, or takes the role as the disinfectant. Okay, or in other words. Hypochlorous acid kills the bacteria, okay, the pathogenic microorganism. So, the fact that the hypochlorous acid present in water, it will be a reacting, a reversible reaction. So, hypochlorous acid can sometimes change to hypochlorite ion and hydrogen ion, and sometimes it will change back to hypochlorous acid. So, hypochlorous acid can disinfect uh, water. So, does hypochlorite ion. So these two are the disinfectant, if you like. Okay, hypochlorous acid and hypochlorite ion. And they are called free chlorine. Okay, so these two can kill bacteria very well and they are called free chlorine. But when you compare between hypochlorous acid and also hypochlorite ion, okay, hypochlorous acid is a lot better uh, than hypochlorite ion. It's more effective in uh, becoming the disinfectant. Um, as if that, you know, this one is like, if I can make an, a simple analogy, okay, hypochlorous acid is like a first class student. It's a very good. Okay, compared to the hypochlorite ion, it's, you know, it's a second class upper. It's not that bad, but, you know, reality is this one is better than this one. Okay, so that is the thing that you need to know. Right. Because of this is a reverse, reversible reaction, okay, so according to Lee Chatelier principle, okay, if you do a change in, in, a, reversible, in a reversible reaction, Okay, the, uh, the reaction will do the opposite. So what it means, okay, if uh, in the water, we try to make the water more acidic. When we talk about making it more acidic, that means we are adding more hydrogen ion. So according to Lee Italia principle, instead, uh, because of we are adding more hydrogen inside in, uh, in this equation or inside the water, that, that has uh, hypochlorous acid, so the reaction will tend to do opposite, to do something else, okay? So we keep adding hydrogen, so it will try to produce more and more and more hypochlorous acid. But, let's say in the water, you want to make it more alkaline. That means you are taking out hydrogen ion. So, Lee Chatelier's principle says that the equation will the reaction will tend to go to the right directions, to these directions. That means we are producing more hypochlorite ion at greater pH. Okay? That's why you have at pH greater than 8, we will be seeing more hypochlorite ion. At pH less than 7 or acidic um, pH in water, we will be seeing more hypochlorous acid. 